in this video I'm going to show you how to do a cache partition reset on a Galaxy Note 10 that is now running Android 11. This video has taken me it's taken me a long time to work out how to do this. My phone updated to Android 11 three or four weeks ago, three weeks ago. And I always like to clear the partition before after sorry after i've done a reset so to do it you used to hold the power key or the bixby key and the volume up key that now doesn't work because it's running android 11. so what you need to do is power off the phone power off Right, so that's powered off. And you need to get your headphones. And you plug your headphone into the headphone port. Turn the back around that way. Then hold the volume up and the power key till the boot screen shows and let go. This is now going to recovery mode. There we go. And then you just do the same as before down to wipe cache partition press enter clear yes reboot system now Once that's rebooted, I'll just show you the old way it used to be to show you that it doesn't work the other way. So we'll unplug the headphones. <coughs> so that's the headphones unplugged. <coughs> just let it boot back up. I'm just going to cover my pin code. Booting back up. All right, so we'll turn it off. Off. Power off. Power off. Just let that close down. That's now gone off. So if I try and turn it on now with the Bixby button, power button, and the volume up button, you'll see what happened. It doesn't go into recovery mode. Let go of the two. There you go, it's gone straight to the boot up screen. So you need to plug your headphones into the headphone port. Why they've done it, I don't know. But this is for Galaxy Note 10s, 10 plus, that are running Android 11.